hello Geminis welcome back to the channel oh. <laughs> I hope everybody is doing very very well so we are going to tap into the next 24 hours and see what the energy is for you so if this resonates you know what to do thumbs up the video here on the YT all the information for me will be in the description box so let's get entwined and see what the energy is for Gemini's Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Holy Father. What do we have for Gemini's next 24 hours? Next 24 hours. What is it looking like for Gemini's next 24 hours? So six of wands in reverse here the judgment we have the chariot we have the queen of pentacles and we have the five of swords in reverse you know what i'm getting like this person did something that was just really unforgettable um, not in a good way by the way <laughs> and now it's like okay I need to get back to where I need to be like I'm just getting a lot of things that was done to you here and they want forgiveness or whoever this person is for you that they're looking for forgiveness they're looking at you as a queen of pentacles they want to come back into your good graces this is what I'm seeing there's a transition that happened because of some kind of karmic effect here within this judgment it's like the angels are saying like i'm not ready to judge this person yet let's give this person the benefit of a doubt to see what this person is going to do if they're going to do the right thing this is someone that you helped this is someone that you gave a lot of energy to this is someone that you put your life on pause for okay tell me more all right, so you have the Four of Cups here. You have the Ace of Wands. You also have the High Priestess. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. I'm also seeing the Page of Wands. I'm seeing the Eight of Swords. And I'm also seeing the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So this person caused a lot of noise within the relationship, within the foundation of this relationship. I feel like for this reading, this is someone that built an energy with this person. You built something, you put time within this person's energy. And you, everything that you have worked for within this person, it has fallen, you have seen it fall, your home fell. You have children for this person in the next 24 hours and everything is just falling apart. And there is like this, this lie that's above everything, okay? And you need clarity and this person is not giving you the clarity that you need. But I also feel like instead of giving you the clarity, they're coming back in and trying to fix this. You know, trying to come in and act like, you know, they have made a mistake um you know they shouldn't have did what they did they shouldn't have stabbed you in the back they shouldn't have shook you the way they did they shouldn't have <laughs> you know wear that mask they should have let you know who they truly are from the beginning like i'm just seeing this huge force of energy and then you know your energy is definitely showing up as a lot of you have cancer within your chart this could be a cancer moon or cancer rising or you could be dealing with a cancer gems but i'm just seeing cancer all over this okay cancer all over this period so i'm seeing like you're not showing your emotions but you do want a new beginning because you're still waiting you're still waiting for this person to grow up this person to give you something this person to change their energy um, and stop coming in and out of your life and stop being hot and cold with their emotions like you're still waiting for this this is what i'm getting here so i'm really getting that force of energy there and it's like this person has this um <laughs> I'm just feeling like it's bothering them that you don't even show your emotions. They can see if you love them, if you hate them. But I'm seeing that you want a second chance. You want to work things out. You're still waiting to, you know, have a new beginning with this Ace of Wands. You want this really quick to come in. You're willing to work something out here. You're willing to have a new perspective and do something different you know but this person is keeping you restricted or lying keeping the lies 
like hidden like <laughs> in the next 24 hours this is what you're dealing with then we have scorpio here in reverse within the death we also have the seven of cups here so this is also overwhelming we have this uh king of wands energy so let's talk about you know the fact that this person doesn't have any leadership roles or the fact that this person doesn't make good decisions here this is what i'm seeing i just feel like this person is quite immature and they get themselves in a lot of trouble they're overwhelmed with all this responsibilities or um, opportunities or choices that they had okay and I feel like they're overwhelmed within this situation so there's a lot of lies that has happened with this person's energy and they don't know what is what who is what kind of vibe I'm also seeing the hangman here so there is no change for this person's energy they don't want to sacrifice or change you guys have a contract the king of wands queen of wands is like you're supposed to be creative or to help each other um you know light the flame within each other's life so i just feel like there's a lot of passion between you and this person like you guys are very attractive as well um you kind of look alike in some ways but i just feel like um there's an energy or a vibration that is different between you and this person like what you want this person doesn't want right now even though it should have worked but I'm also seeing like this person doesn't want to sacrifice. Like I said before, this person is watching you, thinking about you. Yes, they are. <laughs> but and they want to come back. You have the tower here. They want to come back. But there is an energy in reverse. It's like. It was like this masculine situation happening, like somebody trying to be in control here, manipulate the situation, and you guys fell out of that tower. And I'm seeing like they want to come back, but without no change within this energy. This is going to be a problem. The Six of Swords, it's, it's like I'm seeing like the transition, and this transition is very much needed between you and this person. Why there's different cards in here you see what i'm saying different cards i can't tell them apart Ugh. um <laughs> like there was a transition that was needed like you guys needed time apart so this is a separation this is a separation y'all tell me more sun is also in reverse look at the truth you see this person has been lying to you you have the sun in reverse the 11 11 the future is not set we don't even know what's going to happen here they don't even know then you have this justice so we have aries libra cancer major arcanas you guys cancer again right here we have scorpio showing up here within the death and within the uh the, the tower energy along with aries so aries is also over here but libra is over here libra is over here too you know and then you have leo and pisces major arcana whoever those um energies resonates with that is your confirmation we also have Aquarius. All right, so. <laughs> uh, it's like the star is still here. So the divine God is putting work in to kind of like make an opportunity happen between you and this person. We have the Knight of Wands and we have the, the Nine of Cups in reverse. So I'm just getting like there's a lot of empty promises here. You can't depend on this person. Not at all. Like this person doesn't come through for you. It's like they tell you things that they're going to do and they don't do it. Hold on, let me see what the energy is here. Let's see here. What is the energy? Look at that, I'm already getting curse and also cloud cloudy judgment so isolation unbalanced situation here this could be witchcraft 
someone is very desperate negative force of energy negative thinking like i just feel like this person there's like these arguments that are quite passionate and deep and they say things within this heated moment that is just it's like you can feel that it's like planted in the universe the way they say it so they need to be careful with their tongue tell me more release letting go moving on walking away tell me more trapped energy keeping you trapped or in place for their purpose keeping you captive uh, making you feel like there's a chance when they're no like it's not that they don't want a chance with you because i'm seeing a rebuild but i don't feel like this person is going to end up giving you your dreams you know because you have the star trying to make a way and give this person the benefit of a doubt but at the same time in the next 24 hours they're constantly trying to keep these lies to you even though you know there is clearly something huge that happened between you and this person clearly there was a lot of deceit lies betrayal and it was very shocking because you didn't think that this person was capable of hurting you in this way and it was very embarrassing too and because of this i just feel like you know there's a separation here a transition is in play <laughs> because of this and this is someone that you helped this is someone that you nurtured this is someone that you cared about you're coming up as the queen of wands this person is coming up as a king of wands in reverse so it's very stubborn energy here and you're still like this sun energy but your sun is in reverse so you're appearing to be okay and open but you're tired and burnt the hell out so you need to speak up and express yourself okay because you feel like there's a lot of secrets here you feel like this person is concealing everything but i'm seeing a confession coming clean here i feel like this is going to be by text or yeah this is going to be by like some kind of email or text all right this is about the con like this person is conflicted so they're drinking a lot going back and forth within this energy not knowing if this is something that they should do because once they do this and open this and let this all out they can't go back they can't go back and change things so tell me more holy spirit <laughs> it's like this person is having second thoughts you know hangman energy spying on you so there's a separation here i just feel like this person wants to keep up with you but they don't want to change whoever this is is a selfish person one day somewhere another time it's like you're giving up you know I'm, I'm just looking at this and looking at the four of cups like you're really like not in this life uh, i can't do it anymore i can't do it but you're showing up as like nurturing you're not showing up as like blocking your energy at all you have the queen of pentacles queen of um queen of wands here even though this person bit your hands you still have faith you still have your faith you're, you're you have a lot of questions a lot of you are stressed because you know you have to make a decision and there's a lot of arguments and you don't even know why this person is arguing with you for little things there's a lot of attention or no a lot of tension within your relationship deep love unity connection soulmate so this could be your soulmate for some of you within this 24 hour this could be someone that you are married to but there is a distance between you and this person and it's been happening for the longest time and it's just you've been trying to get your relationship back to where it needs to be but it's just haven't been taking place that way and this is a chaser so this is someone that is very toxic like they don't want to be in a relationship but they don't want you to be with anyone else and you're quite alone all the time because this is help like empty boredom hollow shallow energy okay and peace is also coming back into your life but you have to make that decision within this two balls what two balls what you want to do okay balance harmony friendship what do you want to do you have to make that choice because there's also a codependency here or some kind of obsessing it's look at the obsessing spine holding on i feel like it's this person because i'm seeing the spine energy like three times now 
again you know it's like there i feel like this person has this energy of like not being able to give you what you want knowing that they can't but then they're, they're like really selfish as well because they're not letting go Like this person is giving me a vibe that they're not letting go of you. <laughs> All right, tell me about this Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords energy for this person. What's going on with this Eight of Swords? Thank you, Holy Spirit. What's going on for this Eight of Swords? Uh, the King of Pentacles. The Emperor. <laughs> Apology. What is going on here? It's like this person is... Again, coming in, trying to be successful with you. But where's the truth? Is this an apology? They don't have, they don't have no answers for you. Like, why they did what they did. Why they put you through what they put you through. They don't have it. They don't have it, y'all. Okay, let me tap into this person's energy solo. Let's see what we have. Let's see if you need to stay away or what. <laughs> you need to stay away from this person or what. Woo. Okay, so what's this person's energy solo? Angel guides. What's this person's energy solo? 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 Okay, so let's see. Wow, it's quite different. <laughs> okay, incompletion. Well, there you are. All right, so you have the Page of Pentacles. All right, so let's see. Wow, you know this person, ah, my goodness, this is crazy. So they're like acting like right now, like they're, they're good. It's like I'm seeing like they want a future here. Wow, so it's different. They want a future here. They look at you as the sun. They really want to keep fighting for this connection. That's the one I'm seeing, y'all, okay? <laughs> I'm going in. I'm going to win. They really want to keep fighting for this connection. This connection, look, even though they're beaten up and tired and just feel like this has been a long journey and a long road, they look at you as this bright, full, joyful energy within the sun and they want a fulfilled life with you. Isn't this interesting? And... 
there's an incompletion so obviously like i said there was a separation here because this person seemed to not be on the same path with you or vibrate in the same energy is like their attention is somewhere else but they're saying that they're not even overwhelmed with this they're not but their back is still turned to you so this is crazy let me see tell me about this seven here the seven of cups energy for this person seven of cups energy the next 24 seven of cups energy what's the seven of cups energy what's the seven of cups energy seven of cups the king of pentacles in reverse it's like they want to be in some kind of they're avoiding you like you see what i'm saying it's like they're avoiding you here They're saying there was some kind of mental craziness that happened that put a blockage on you or you decide to put a blockage on them. <laughs> but now this is lifted. Tell me about this connection, Holy Spirit. What's the connection? <coughs> Excuse me, you guys. <clears throat> Tell me about this connection. It says it's safe for you to love. It says open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So it's easy. It, it is safe for you to love. I'm about to say easy. What the hell? Okay, so that's what I'm seeing here. Like you don't trust this person, but it's the angels are saying like it's safe for you to love here. This person is a positive vibe, you guys. I don't know what's going on. This person is a positive vibe. Like, this person is praying. This person has a lot of things that they are going through within the Nine of Swords. And it's like a constant vibration of depression. But I feel like they're trying to release this force of energy because it's severe. I'm also seeing the Knight of Cups. So they are coming back. Now, they feel like the star is not on their side for something. Like, there's a loss of faith here. But there's a positive vibe. They're coming in because something seemed lost. Within this situation, they look at you as the Queen of Pentacles. They, they look at you as the, 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 like the power. This is you, Gems. Gems. Right here, Gemini and Virgo. I'm also seeing Leo within their energy. Scorpio, Gemini, Aquarius, uh, Taurus, Leo. Okay. Tell me more. Release your ex. Ooh. It's time, the time has come to clear your energy. It's crazy because these two are talking about energy right here. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. The highest vibration here. You're here to experience a 10 with this person. Angels have spoken, baby. Okay. Why am I getting like some of you are just still on your ex? This is not the person that they're talking about. And this relationship died because of it. Like there is this constant reminder of someone being in a relationship with someone else. <laughs> Keep an open mind. A lot of you are like, this ain't my soulmate. And they're saying like, your soulmate may be different from, from your usual type of expectations. So your ex. A lot of you are thinking your ex is your soulmate, but the person that this person is actually your soulmate. That is crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoa. So keep an open mind. My gosh. Sometimes your soulmate is not attractive in life. Sometimes your soulmate is, you know, they just want to see if you can find them. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> deception here Ooh, somebody is wearing a false self mask in this relationship a false self mask i just feel like you know what since i pulled this person's energy by itself it's like 
damn i do see the fact that they're holding things like there's a lot of things that this person has that they're hiding they're trying to protect themselves here they're coming back trying to give you something back even though this situation may be feeling hopeless but they're still coming in with prayer manifestation once in a second chance yeah apologizing as well within the situation okay you have this page of wands you also have the page of cups you have the eight of pentacles so clearly there's a loss here there's a loss within this energy but there's an apology and there's no new direction like this person doesn't know or they're not passionate about something here they're not giving me passionate i'm also seeing the devil's energy so clearly this person is stuck into something there's a lot of conflicts and they're looking at you as the power the spiritual power wow cancer energy again capricorn energy for those of you who the capricorn and the devil this person is just like now you see the toxic vibes but they're looking at you as the sun the 11 11 they feel good when they're with you there is a lot of things that has been going on within this person's life that they haven't told you about within their childhood deception somebody wearing a fake mask it's like this person is trying to be something that they're not because they don't want you to see their true face and what the things that they have been through because they feel like you're going to look at them weak or different or tainted the six of swords is like this person did not want this connection to end but they didn't do much about it but i'm getting the everything is fine card so the mental and physical agony is going to be resolved. I'm also seeing the Six of Cups. And then we have the Moon energy here. Listen to your intuition, you guys. There's a lot of confusion here because of the secrets that are being held. It's about this person environment. And I'm also seeing like they're having a hard time with this King of Pentacles energy taking off. I feel like this person just got out of something really crazy. Um, there's a lot of bad things that happen between you and this person. Mm. And they don't know where things are going to go, but they're keeping like a happy. It's like every time like this person thinks about something bad, maybe this is a client of mine. <laughs> because I'm about to say every time this person is thinking about something bad here, this person is like thinking about something good with the situation because the six of cups in reverse is like bad memories bad past life situation you know like it's like a lot of toxic situations that happened like the memories are not great but i'm just seeing like this person is turning it into something positive <sighs> so they're really praying for you and hoping for you to come back they look at you as an empress omg in the next 24 hours <laughs> this is what's going on all right so what's the energy here for gemini holy spirit with this read this beautiful read let's see let's see let's see let's see let's see let's see what's going on okay so oop oop you got four bumblebee energy oh my god you have a lot of responsibilities a lot of responsibilities and dedication to your responsibilities so you might seem a little busy <laughs> you might seem a little busy but i feel like if this is if this person is a part of that then you'll make time for this person there's a lot of changes happening as well within this energy i feel like you are strong enough look at this leadership role they look at you as very powerful you're the gorilla period you are not a follower you are a leader okay but you need to change your face why you look so mean <laughs> 
why you look so serious i know this person did a lot but you know and then you have the anaconda energy so there's a lot of things that have happened that you felt like it's not balanced out here and you want balance you feel like you're just moving you know side to side you feel like this person might be juggling you you feel like this person might be playing games with you within the anaconda but you're going to with this gorilla energy you're going to get to the bottom of this and this is what this person um they don't like that you're masculine because this is what broke you guys up in the first place or making you have problems within your relationship but they like the fact that you're very spiritual and powerful like they know that you can do this they look at you as a son even though they're very prideful they feel like you get them out of a lot and this is what the six of wands is in reverse because this is why they have a karmic energy because they have you have been the light to their lives and they have bit that energy but this is what i have you guys i hope that it resonates if it does you know what to do here i hope you like the videos like this this is how we're going to push through the videos and i will be doing your last video of the day which is your energy pull i don't know if i'm going live today you guys but we'll see um because today's a beautiful day i do have some personals to get out of the way and then we're gonna see what my energy is period love you guys and see you guys in your next one bye guys